What's up guys, this is Omega Liar, and uh, I just woke up a few minutes ago, but I'm feeling pretty good right now, uh, aside from my voice. And, um, well, I just wanted to get up, make a commentary for you guys, because it's been a while, and uh, so just uh, throw that bull crap out of the way. I'm just go back into, into the routine of making videos every day, every morning, every night, whenever I want to, and uh, get back to what I really enjoy doing, because... Uh, I really do enjoy doing this, but um, anyway, about the gameplay real quick. Uh, this gameplay is actually very, very old. Uh, most of my gameplays for a little bit will be because uh, I have to get new ones. Um, I played it for a little bit yesterday, and I played for a little bit before, and I got one or two gameplays, but because I haven't played so long, getting gameplays isn't very easy at this moment, so uh, I have to get... Oh, excuse me. Sorry about that. <laughs> but, um... Right, so get, getting game place isn't the easiest thing at the moment because I just haven't played so long. I'm still getting back into it, but it, it'll it'll get easier. I have a lot of time to play now, and I'm actually getting into the new mode. Uh, what's what's going to be happening is I have to make tons and tons and tons of videos for Spain because uh, I'm not going to be able to be here. I'm not going to be able to play at all, um, and that needs to get done. So that's that's what I'm starting to work on now, just to ensure that you guys will have plenty of entertaining videos, uh, whether it be. I was thinking of putting together maybe some little edits, trying to find music that isn't copyrighted. Uh, I was also considering, um, I was also considering maybe posting some of your commentaries that you guys would want, uh, just to give people a chance at maybe getting a little bit of an audience. I have a, I mean, my audience is, is what it is. I, I'm happy with it, so that's cool. But um, anyway, uh, today's topic uh, I wanted, or at least what I wanted to talk about is. Something that I think every sane commentator touches on at one point or another, um, and that would be the state of the community. It's the most generic. <laughs> it's so generic, but um, anyway, uh, because I mean, we're in what is it? We're in June, and the game is pretty much halfway through its life, um, unless it would be COD Four or COD Five, in which case it lasted a lot longer than it was supposed to. Um, but in this case, I think the game is about halfway through its life. Uh, Black Ops 2 will probably come in and replace it. Um, I have a feeling, uh, obviously no one knows anything really, but I have a feeling that Black Ops 2 is going to be pretty good. Um, but, like, halfway through a game, you, at least in this point in Call of Duty during Black Ops, just Black Ops 1, uh, everyone was like, oh my god, I need the new Call of Duty. Uh, everything, everything in this game sucks, the lag is bad, the guns suck, the FAMAS is overpowered, all that stuff. And people were really starting to get sick of the game about halfway through. Um, I don't think that's the case in Modern Warfare 3. That was definitely the case in Modern Warfare 2. Uh, actually the thing is though, Modern Warfare 2, I picked it up late. So I got to miss most of the bull crap that was going on, I didn't get the care package glitch. Uh, I didn't get any of the uh, the super. I, I don't even remember to be honest, but there were so many glitches in that game. There's so many overpowered guns. That game is still uh, surrounded and crowded with overpowered guns, but there's not much you can really do about that. Uh, so that that's the stuff you deal with. But the care package glitch and all that stuff going on there. Oh, I remember javelin glitch and semtex glitch. That uh, just never got fixed when it needed to be. Um, but then Black Ops came, and I thought Black Ops was good throughout, uh, which reminds me, I do want to get you guys some Black Ops gameplay, because, uh, it's always good to go back to a game that I basically started my channel. Um, anyway. Uh, but Modern Warfare 3, I feel like it's got a little bit more staying power than Black Ops, which is good, which means they did something right, which means they actually did take a step forward, even though people love to complain, but that will always happen. No one, like, Activision is not going to be clear of complaints. Uh, they get their fair share from me. Um, they get their fair share from the community. Uh, do they always take it in mind what the community is saying? No. Should they? No. But there is a lot of stuff that could be done. Um, I would say for Modern Warfare 3, the biggest thing in my head is... Um, yeah, I would say off the top of my head, the biggest thing that they need to fix is some of the weapon balance. I still think that they need to buff weaker guns. I don't think they need to... Like, at this point in the game, nothing is so overpowered that it just needs to be gone. But I think there are enough guns that are just not powerful enough that could be made more powerful that would actually increase how much fun you can have with this game. Because the fact is, if you're only going to use 
three guns over and over and over again. Uh, what fun is that? No, no one can possibly enjoy that for a full year. Um, and I think that would be the main thing that Call of Duty needs to focus on. It has to be weapon mounts. You need to be able to use any gun in this game and do well. But that just isn't the case. How did I survive that grenade? <laughs> but, um... Oh, look at that sticky ninja. Anyway, getting off topic. Um... But I... I mean, I thought about it for a little bit. I just... Before I made this commentary, I sat on my bed, bed thinking about what I wanted to talk about. And... I, I got to the conclusion that really the most important thing that you can have in this Call of Duty, aside from 60 frames per second, and aside from good looking graphics, and aside from good maps, maps is big, that's big, they sort of screwed up in this game, but, uh, it really is weapon balance, because, and that's just not, that's not weapon balance for a few select guns, that's weapon balance for every gun. Uh, I use my favorite gun as an example, the PM9. It's good, it's, it is, but it's not that good. No, like and they're, to the, compared to the UMP, which isn't even overpowered, it should it it doesn't compare. The UMP is much better. It's much easier to use. It's much more controllable. And then you get guns like the MP7 and the uh, PP90 that just absolutely destroy the UMP. So that that puts you at three tiers of weapon. You have the low tier, the middle tier, and the high tier. And that can't happen because that means that anyone trying to use the low tier, or the middle tier, is at a disadvantage. Um, and that can really, really suck the life out of a game because you want it. You want to use guns, but you don't want to use the same ones. And if you use different guns that people don't use, you get screwed. You don't win. You don't get killed. You don't do any of that sort of stuff. Um, and I think that's ridiculous. I think if th there's no reason that they shouldn't have that formula down. Getting getting unbounds right. Any Call of Duty person can see what they need to do. Uh, let's let I'll just pick let's pick three guns uh, that are particularly underpowered in this game. Uh, I'll say let's oh obviously the PM9. Um, let's take not the KSG. Let's take then the Spaz and let's take the uh, the Peshnik PKP or whatever it's called. Um, the PM9. All they have to do is reduce the recoil a little bit. It's just out of control. It's ridiculous. Obviously, it's good at spraying, but the gun needs to have a little bit more than that in order to be effective against guns like the MP7 and PP90. Uh, now for the Spaz 12. Uh, obviously, increase the range, increase the power a little bit. A little bit. Don't, nothing drastic. Uh, or drastic. <laughs> How do you say drastic? Uh, nothing drastic, and uh, they could definitely make that gun useful, but. As of right now, how many people use this fast well? Raise your hand if you do. No, no one can see it. If you raise your hand, you look a little foolish, but no one can see it. Um, but no one uses it because no one can use it because it's not easy um, for anyone. All the, it, it's just like anyone can use the KSG-12 over the Spaz-12 because KSG-12 is more powerful and has longer range. Why would you ever use this fast? Uh, as for the PKP, I mean, I would say just reduce the recoil. Because as far as as far as as far as it goes, the uh, LED6, which has the same exact power, basically recoils less, except for visual. But uh, so, and it's just like the little things like that that anyone could point out. You could talk, look at any gun. Uh, not talking about top tier here. Top tier would be the guideline, because that's the fast-paced guns. Those are that's what we're looking for. But we need every gun to be like that. In the same sense that no gun will be not. That's like incredible crap. Um, anyway, gameplay is running to an end here. Uh, this is a little little fun commentary I wanted to make about uh, about Call of Duty community as it stands today. Like every commentator that ever has done one. But I thought I thought it'd be pretty interesting. Let me know in the comments what you think about the topic because I'm curious to see what you guys are thinking about the community right now. Um, and I guess I think it's running down to it. Should end soon. It's eight thirty, eight minutes thirty. Yeah. Um. Right. So just let let me know what you think. Um. That that's about it. Uh, if you guys enjoy this commentary, I need your support now more than ever. Uh, for those of you still watching, remember to give me a comment. Uh, preferably a rate. I like rates better. <laughs> to be honest, I'll respond to the comments though. Uh, and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next commentary. It's like forty and sixteen, but I got a lot of object objective play, a lot of uh, assists. Uh, and uh, I'll see you in my next commentary, so thank you for watching. Peace out.